Hey guys, it's me, Mr. 250, and welcome back to Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door. Um, so we're back again, uh, this is going to be a short video, I think, but what I want to do is I want to run down to Poketail's castle and get that, um, that item that allows us to upgrade twice. Uh, that's something I've been wanting to get for a while, and... Well, getting it would be helpful, and I forgot exactly if where he said it was. Um, beyond the reversible stair, so beyond the stair that flipped, near the empty black chest lies a clue to help your allies learn. It's probably near... I think I remember a crack being in that one room with the big spikes that fell towards us. So we're going to go run and do that, but unfortunately you've seen most of this before. So how about... I will skip to when we're close to that room, and then um, we can do that. We can go grab it, and then we'll skip back to when we're over here and use it, and any interesting dialogue that happens between, because I think most of it's going to be rather boring, so this will be a very short video in total. But I hope you guys enjoy regardless, and uh, let's see. Is it this pipe? Yeah, it's this pipe. So I'll see you when I get over there. And if anything interesting happens along the way for some reason, I'll let you know that as well. So, uh, be back in a bit. Okay, so now we're up to where the room with the, uh, the black chest was, which is what he was describing at one point. And he said beyond this was where our chest we were looking for was. Okay, I think we're safe. Now, remember there being a hole in the wall over here, or a crack, yes. Excellent. Can we go? Thank you. Ah, okay, what do we got here? Ooh. I, li I like transition. Transition is very cool. That's, I, that's a great transition. I wish I could do stuff like that. You got an up arrow. It's unclear what this means. You should ask someone. Well, I... I don't know. Alright, so now that we've got this, I'm going to head back. It's going to be a little while, so I'll meet you back over there. I think we have to talk to the guy and he'll tell us what to do with it. Alright, and now we're back, and I think if we talk to the guy in here, he'll tell us what to do with it. Let's just see. Up arrow. What's this? An up arrow? Huh? An up arrow? Up? Uh... Of course! Whoa? Huh? Oh, I think I know. Yeah, it was up in the in the attic. That's what it was. This is the Ultra Stone, so that is what the star sign meant. I picked this up at a flea market years ago and forgot it was in the attic. With this, I can power up your partners even more. Cool. Ooh. Cool. We are cooking now. Let me know when you want to power up your allies more. And there's actually... Um, and let me know if you guys want me to do this. There's actually an optional ally you can get. We've actually seen the character before. And they're a pretty neat ally. Not too bad. Um, I like using them. But uh, if you, you know, if you don't really care, you know then I'll just keep going with this. If someone lets me know, though, I'll go pick them up before the end of the game. So, let's power up our characters. Uh, let's power up Bobbery again. You can use bob bob -omb Mast to attack all enemies. Shall I power up this partner? Yes. And it's still three like before, so we can actually, I think, power up just about everyone. And I'm not going to repeat this. Oh, shiny. And this one's really useful, because even though Bobbery has the attack where he can attack, he can throw out all the bombs. Um, this one's super useful, because the problem with that one is they're timed bombs. It takes a little while. But, whoops. But this one, even though it uses a, a quite a bit more, it does, I think it does more damage, and also it's just a huge massive blast that attacks all of them, so it's pretty neat. 
And what I'm going to do is off camera, I'm going to level up as many characters as I can to level two. And uh, but that's that's the end for today. That's just a little side video. I'm sure this wasn't more than five minutes, maybe maybe six, seven. I'm not sure. Um, but next time we're going to come back and we will continue our uh, our trip to Far Outpost, which is where we were supposed to be going last. So I hope you guys enjoyed and. Come back next time for more Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. Bye!